Welcome viewers. BTS's V Shakes America Today, Most Spectacular Asian Solo Artist in 2024. Without wasting time, please take a second to hit the subscribe button and flip on notification bell for greater updates and watch this video till the end. But now that I'm alone, I don't talk much. BTS Monument Series explores the impact of the pandemic on their music and their lives. The BTS series Monuments, Beyond the Star offers insight into the seven-member Korean boy band. In the new 7th to 8th episode, we find out how Jean, Suga, RM, J-Hope, Jimin, Jungkook, and V are dealing with the pandemic and its impact on their music production and concerts. Episode 7 begins with the formation of Permission to Dance and their first show at Allegiant Stadium in Los Angeles during the pandemic. In the episode, they talk about how grateful they are for this opportunity and think about what it would be like if it was the end. V shares how hard BTS has worked to connect with their fans and armies, and his words likely touch the hearts of many fans. But there's more to come. V also talks about the time he went from being a joker to being serious. After finishing their schedule in LA, the BTS members returned to Seoul, South Korea, and the experience seems to have had a big impact on them. The two shared a room for seven to eight years and are now living alone in their new home. The transition has been difficult during the pandemic. Jimin seemed devastated, but Jungkook was there for him. Meanwhile, V shared details about the various changes he's undergone during this time. BTS V reflects on the turning point that made him take himself more seriously. Taking a tour of his home, the layover singer explained how he became the interior designer for the house and even offered fans a visual journey into his beautiful home. He then continued, I feel that way sometimes too. We were very lively when we lived together, but now that I'm alone, we don't talk much. He continued, saying that he's getting used to living alone and spending a lot of time playing video games and listening to music. Also read, BTS's V appears straight out of an anime on the cover of Harper's Bazaar. In one scene, he was filmed lying on a couch saying, When I was younger, I was too active, too playful, too much of a joker, but after I discovered the beauty and joy of peace and quiet, I really began to appreciate it. He continued, I don't talk anymore. I'm happy that I don't have to talk. So for now, I think I'm happy being alone. It really makes me feel like I'm taking a break. He concluded the conversation by describing his phase as simple but definite happiness. A music video teaser for one of the B-side songs from V's solo album was released on BTS official social media channels on August 22nd. It depicts V walking expectantly down a hallway, stopping in front of a door and knocking. A background of instruments creates even more excitement behind him. Combining an old R&B style with a bright voice, V shows off his jazz background in the song Blue. On the August 21st Billboard chart, V's Love Me Again, released on August 11th, entered the Hot 100 at No. 96. This is his second entry as a solo artist, having previously achieved this feat several times with BTS. Billboard also ranked Love Me Again at No. 3 on this week's best-selling songs. Fans fell in love with the song's R&B yet soulful sound, even moving to tears to the song. The second episode of In the Soup Frankation was recently released, and one of the highlights was a shirtless snap of BTS Kim Taehyung, aka V. For the uninitiated, and the SOOP Frankation is a spin-off of the popular series I and the SOOP, featuring the Wooga team, which consists of Park Seo Joon, V, Peak Boy, and Park Hyung Sik. The episode shows the troupe enjoying things like swimming. In one of these scenes, V is seen gazing out from the pool without a shirt on. And that was enough to make the entire fanbase weak at the knees. Since the episode was released, armies on Twitter have been sharing snaps of V and commenting on how attractive he looks. One fan wrote, Tame so hot, while another wrote, Hashtag Kim 